let's read the question students magnetic moment of a trivalent metal ion is 5.916 bm the atomic number of the metal is the given options are 26 27 28 or 29 plus in this question we are given with the value of magnetic moment which is 5.916 bohr's magneton there's a formula to calculate magnetic moment which is under root n n plus 2 bm plus here n is the number of unpaired electrons since we are given with the value of mu which is 5.916 we can identify the value of n which is number of unpaired electron which is equals to 5 so class we have to identify the atomic number of a metal which when present in its 3 plus oxidation state has 5 unpaired electron it is very clear iron which has atomic number 26 has configuration argon 3d6 4s2 in its 3 plus oxidation state the configuration will be 3d5 so we can clearly say that iron in its 3 plus state has 5 unpaired electrons as a result the magnetic movement becomes 5.916 so the correct answer for this question is option number 1 atomic number 26 which is iron let's move to the next question students which is question number 52 let's read the question students acidified K2Cr2O7 will oxidize sulfides in 2 the given options are sulfates next is sulfur the next is thiosulfates or the last option is sulfur dioxide students this is a very important and a very common question as it is very clear that sulfides changes to sulfur when it is oxidized using K2Cr2O7 I am writing the balanced equation which is Cr2O7 2 minus plus 3H2S plus 8H plus because the reaction is an acidic medium gives 2 Cr 3 plus plus 3 sulfur and 7 water molecule so the correct answer for this question is option number 2 as sulfide ions changes to sulfur so the correct answer is option number 2 let's move to the next question class which is question number 53 let's read the question class how many moles of AgCl will be precipitated if one mole of CrNH3 whole 6 Cl3 is added to excess of AgNO3 solution? The given options are 1, 2, 3 or 4. Plus first of all we have to identify the number of ions produced in aqueous medium by the coordination complex given in the question. Let's see. CrNH3 whole 6 Cl3 in solution ionized to give CrNH3 whole 6 3 plus plus 3 Cl minus. So we can see that 3 moles of chloride ion are produced in the solution. So when this is added to excess of AgNO3 solution 3 moles of AgCl will be precipitated out so the correct answer for this question is option number 3 students let's move to the next question which is question number 54 let's read the question students among the following which element shows the greatest number of oxidation states the given options are copper, zinc, manganese or iron. Plus let's start the question. Plus for copper only two oxidation states are possible which is plus 1 or plus 2. Let's move to zinc. For zinc only one oxidation state is possible which is plus 2. Let's come to the next option students which is Mn, manganese. For manganese six different oxidation states are possible which is plus two plus three plus four plus five 
plus 6 and plus 7. Mn has the highest oxidation state in 3D series which is plus 7. Let's move to the last option which is Fe iron which shows four different oxidation states which are plus 2, plus 3, plus 5 or plus 6. So class it is very clear that manganese shows the greatest number of oxidation states among the given options. So the correct answer is option number 3. Let's move to the next question students which is question number 55. Let's read the question students. An iron which gives colorless aqueous solution is. The given options are titanium 4 plus, chromium 3 plus, manganese 2 plus or nickel 2 plus. So class here we have to identify that which iron gives a colorless aqueous solution. And for this we need to know that when the atom or ion has no unpaired electron, its aqueous solution is colorless. So let's see which ion has no unpaired electron. Let's start with number 1, titanium 4 plus. Since the atomic number of titanium is 22, when it is in 4 plus oxidation state, it will have D0 configuration. That means no unpaired electron. Let's come to the next option, students, which is chromium 3 plus. As we know that the atomic number of chromium is 24, in its 3 plus oxidation state, it has D3 configuration. That means it has 3 unpaired electrons. Let's move to the next option, which is Mn2 plus. As we know, the atomic number of manganese is 25. In its 2 plus oxidation state, the configuration becomes D5. That means it has 5 unpaired electrons. Let's go to the last option which is nickel 2 plus. The atomic number of nickel is 28. In its 2 plus oxidation state the configuration becomes D8. That means it has 2 unpaired electrons. So it is very clear that only titanium 4 plus has no unpaired electron. Therefore, the aqueous solution of titanium 4 plus will be colorless. So the correct answer is option number 1. Let's go to the next question class 